This is what a 3,000 Saudi Real ticket gets you at a Milan Derby in Saudi Arabia, but it all starts the day before in London. Today, I will fly to Saudi Arabia. Why may you ask? Well, I made a vote. Where should I go to? And the second most popular vote was Al Nasser for the football in Saudi. I've never been to this country. I don't know if I'm safe to go. My visa's been accepted and I'm gonna board this flight. I'm excited. I'm a little bit worried. Don't know what to expect. I've never been to a country like this, especially going on my own, but it's gonna be a laugh. Pretty empty flight. Get a little, little pillow, little blanket. It's a day flight, so it should be all right. Little double bed, TV, loads of space. It's one of the biggest hotel rooms I've ever had. And wait, wait till you see in here. Come in here. Walk in shower. It's like the biggest shower you've ever seen. Gonna get some sleep. We've got the Italian Super Copa tomorrow. Into Milan versus AC Milan. I've been to that match at San Siro twice now. Let's see how it compares to Riyadh. I'm gonna get some sleep. I've got a cheeky Maccas. The Saudi chicken mac. Look at that. It's got layers of it. Right, I'm gonna eat that. Go to bed and we'll see you in the morning. Bye-bye. Good morning from Riyadh. Let's see what's going on with the view. Not too much. Let's get down to breakfast and see what this hotel has to offer. Taking all the scranning, cheeky omelette to start with the day. Gosh, defo scranning. Get through this and on to something else. So time to answer the big question. What am I, foggy boy, doing in Saudi Arabia, Riyadh to be precise? Well, we're going to football. Of course, why else would I be going anywhere? And we're doing the Italian Supercoppa tonight. The Milan derby happening in Riyadh, not in the San Siro. And to make things even more special, someone from this video is gonna win a signed shirt from one of the players in the game tonight. So stay tuned for that. Yeah. Welcome to the King Abdullah Financial District here in Riyadh. We're just looking around to find somewhere for lunch. Very built up, you see skyscrapers all over the gap. Part of Riyadh that I've never been to. I think you're in a hotel reception. Look, we've got meters. What's He's up? back. He's back. Bro, I saw you in Morocco last. Absolutely. We met Sadio Mane the last time I saw you. So who are we going to meet on this trip? CR7. What? No way. You can't say those things, bro. CR7. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Really, yeah? Paper sign. We're on the cart. We're in the boulevard now. Having a little look around. Pretty nice. <laughs> wow. Saudi's got a little... We're going around on a buggy here on the boulevard. Tell you what. Pretty nice, isn't it, Mutas? It is, absolutely. I'm quite sure. So do you like Al Halal coffee or Al Nasser coffee? Those are the two best teams in Saudi Arabia and potentially Messi will go Al Halal. Well, I have to actually make a choice. Do I support Al Nasser or Al Halal? I don't know. That tastes like promotion. Look who we've got. It's Khaled. Salam. Bro, Hello, Allah. it's a Welcome. pleasure to meet you. It's a pleasure. Welcome. I'm a pleasure to meet you. Listen, it's my it's my nice first time in you. Saudi. My yeah. first time. Ah, welcome, welcome. You will see a, a lot of good things here. Okay. And you will love Saudi Arabia. Yeah. I saw your prediction. You say two one one. You say yeah, two one. I, say, I said that. Okay, two one. Great two, to one, meet you. One. I think two one. AC Milan. Uh, just tell tell the fans what just happened. You got stopped by Saudi police, yeah. Uh, hi. <laughs> They're not letting him in the stadium. What do you mean kicked out? I've not even got in yet. They said. Ben's vlogs are not as good as Dogden's vlogs. You're not welcome in the King Fard. It's legit. Well, I told you, and I'm here as well, bro. Here as well. Nice you were you were in Manchester. I was in London just a day ago. Yeah. You were in Dubai the other day. You were yeah, everywhere. Hey, How are you not what, tired? What's excitement, man? You just you got hyped again. Yeah, you, you don't need 64 sleep. 64 games in the World Cup. This is nothing, bro. We're living a dream life, man. Come on. Look at this structure, the King Fard Stadium. Let's get in here and find out what goes down. I think Inter Milan. Really? Who's gonna get the last goal, the winning goal? Luca. Three, two as well. Look at the service here in Saudi. Absolutely beautiful. There we go. Does it get the Thogden acceptance? Everyone knows I love my brew. It's like English breakfast style to be fair. And Tamori, the English legend, Rafael Liao, Giroud up top. Not bad at all. And for Inter, it's Lautaro and Edin. I met Edin this summer in Croatia, funnily enough. The AC Milan ultras are here. They brought about 300 fans. It's a long way over to Saudi Arabia, but fair play to them. They got a few less, but at the same time, there's still a turnout from the Curva North. But this is my seat today. Take a look at this view. Bosh. We've got the Milan. We've got the Inter. And we've got the King Fard Stadium now. I must say, if you use this stadium on FIFA, you have an elite opinion. You have great football knowledge and great taste. It's all kicking off. Look, someone with a Milan flag has infiltrated the Inter Curva Nord section. 2-0 Milan. 
Oh. We are pitch side here at King Fudd Stadium. The teams are out. I've just given away a Lukaku signed shirt. Put the picture on the screen. Someone can win that on my Instagram right now. Get over there. Look at this. Bang. The King Fudd Stadium. Absolute madness. I'm already loving Saudi Arabia. Like the country, it's my first day here. It's one of my favorite countries I've ever visited. There's so much going on in Riyadh. Oh and I can't wait to see it. Who's your, who's your Saudi club? Who's your ah, team? My Saudi club. Who is uh, it? All, all. All of them. The champions. <laughs> all of them. One month. Me, one month. Yeah. Okay, okay. You can do it. This video gets 20,000 likes. I will do one month in Saudi Arabia. And I will help you. The Milan Ultras. <laughs> now these are the, these are the normal fans. The, uh, the Milan Ultras are actually over there with their banners out. Dio, Dio. I can't believe really you prefer AC Milan simply because they have the Theo in their team. The Inter fans are ready with the yellow balloons. Love it, absolutely love it. 2-1 AC Milan. 2-1 AC Milan. Who's going to win? Look, these guys love the channel. Who's going to win? Uh, AC Milan. AC Milan, look. Oh, <laughs> he loves it. Rafael Leal, yeah? Yes. Scram, bit of salad, bit of fruit. Pretty much scram the teams about. Given away a signed Lukaku shirt to one of you who liked this video. Comment down below why I should give you this Lukaku shirt. I want a real reason. Give me a proper reason. The fire show and the big Italian Super Cup trophy. Wrong winner. And that will find out today. Look at these fireworks, honestly. Above the stadium as well. Now it's time for the winner of that big trophy. The players are coming out. Now is all for the Italian. Northern side clubs, blue versus red. Having been at two Milan derbies at San Siro, it feels weird that it's in any other than that temple of a ground. It's like a light show on the seats, going different colours. Only one side can do it. I'll tell you what, some passion from these Milan fans. You can hear them. This is not. This is louder than some Premier League games, and they've flown all the way to Saudi for it. Milan kick us off. Inter fans on the other side. Some Premier League atmosphere are quieter than this. Unbelievable. Inter are 1-0 up. <laughs> Inter Milan are 1-0 up in Saudi Arabia. You blinked and it went in. Edin Dzeko at the back post. And look at these lights on every seat. It's going blue. Even the Milan section. Oh. Marco on the right flank gets the final finishing. Thank you for watching the videos, legend. Who's going to win today? Inter. Inter, yeah? yeah. They're 1-0 up. I'm yeah. hoping to win AC Milan. Oh, a comeback for AC Milan. Let's see. Rafael Liao, saved. Great save from Andre Nana. Unbelievable scenes. Edin Dzeko makes it 2-0 to Inter. I don't know what's going on. This is the crumble of AC Milan. This guy's, this guy's talking into it. I don't know if he's a stadium announcer or something. Marco with the first, Edin Dzeko with the second. We saw him. This summer in Croatia. Now we're seeing him score goals in Saudi. Unbelievable stuff. They're in cruise control. Milan needs to come back. Now we've got the teas in. All the drink and food is included in this ticket that we're in. 3,000 SAR, which is about $900. And it's a silver ticket over with gold. The gold lounge is even a level above this. The view is, is decent. But right now, Inter in full control. It's not quite the atmosphere of San Siro, shall we say. It's cool they're trying new things for, for the Super Cup. And to have it in Saudi Arabia is, yeah, it's great for the local fans who live here. Half time here. In the match, Rafael Liao runs into danger. Milan fans not happy with their players as they walk off. It's been a very cool experience to be at Saudi Arabia for the Milan derby. And this ticket would have costed $800. So we went pitch side, we're going to get some food and drink. This is kind of what you get. I saw you in Suk Wakif in yes. Qatar, yes. now yes. you're here. Yes, I'm here too. That's unreal. Who's going to win this game? Obviously, we're uh, The Milan fans are not happy though. Yeah, oh. <laughs> Mate, great to see you again. Yeah, you enjoy football out here? Thank you. Yeah, I love it. And we are back out for the second half. What surprises to come this time round? Who was it? Could Milan start a comeback? Oh. That could have been the beginning of something. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Repping Saudi! That is class, man. What a guy. All the way from Qatar. Mutaz, what's going on here? Well, they just. Some Arabic chants going on. Arabic? Arabic chants. That's the ultra, that's the curve of suit. Above the ultra section is like all the local AC Milan fans like joining in. The local Milan fans can join in with the ultras, it's pretty cool. The Milan ultras with the local Saudi lads. This is why they're a great, this is why people want to support them. Most people on usual plastic seats, but take a look at this. It's like a, it's like a cinema seat, this, honestly. Get a proper, proper bit of leg room as well. Look at that. Worth every penny, that's what you, that's what you pay the bonus for. You get the food and drink as well, which is always good. Yeah, this, this game time. 
Wow. He's gone over to the fans. This is unbelievable. Everyone's running over there. Inter are now 3 0 up. AC Milan was so much better the last time I watched them live. Inter are completely running away with it now. In the 78th minute, it is 3 0 to Inter. I just can't believe what's going on here. I have no idea. But the Curva Nord is loving it. Lautaro with the third. And we're underway again. You've got to wonder what the boys in red and black are thinking right now. 51,357 fans. It just shows the love for the Milan derby here in Saudi Arabia. Come outside the gates from the stadium, taking you straight to the business. Wow. This is worth the 3,000 Saudi. This is dessert, by the way. It's not lasagna. It's not a Wembley-sized lasagna. You got the popcorn. <laughs> That's what you get. Bit of strand, bit of a drink. Can't complain. Back of the seat for the final few kicks, and we're finishing off with a little tea. Tomorrow we go again. Al Nasser against PSG. Well, it's Al Nasser, Al Halal. The captain's going to be Ronaldo against Messi, Neymar, Mbappe. The lot. It's going to be the best game of football you will ever see, and maybe the last time Messi plays Ronaldo. So get notifications on. And I'm sure the curve and order's got bigger. We're seeing, we're seeing the Saudis get involved with the ultras now. Look, look, look at this. Look at the passion. And that is full time. The first match in Saudi Arabia complete. The Super Copa winners, as you can tell from the left bench running over, is the boys in blue and black. It's Inter Milan with a smashing 3 0 win. Lautaro with the final goal. Enjoyed the game? Yes. Who are you supporting? I Inter, Inter, yeah? Yes. Congratulations, man. Time for a light show, eh? You can't say Saudi don't disappoint. Finally ticked off the King Fahd Stadium. Not many can say that. Let's go, Bolton! Come on! I love Bolton! Who's the biggest team in England? Bolton Wanderers! Let's go! Let's go! Massive club, that's all I'm saying. And as the Inter players are currently celebrating outside, we're inside chilling. Oh my god. Great seat, really enjoyed it. They know how to do hospitality here in Saudi Arabia. Look at the display. This is the beginning of an even bigger trip. Smash the like button and subscribe with notifications turned on because there is so much Saudi football content to come. I'm so excited. They know how to do this, don't they? What a show they put on here. So we'll see you tomorrow for the Messi-Ronaldo match. It does not get bigger than this. Thank you, King Fahd. See you in a bit.